Welcome friends to the channel of Ripple's Nature Inspire Aquarium. Today I'm going to speak about our equipment which if used in planted aquarium for that matter you can use it in a fresh only tank, a fish only tank or a marine tank also which can actually give you a lot of benefits. I'm talking about a surface schema. Okay. In this video I'm going to explain why do you actually need a surface schema in a planted tank. Okay. And we will do a detailed unboxing of a particular brand of surface schema and I'll come to it shortly and also show you the installation steps. So the topic of this video is why you need a surface schema, unboxing of a surface schema and installation of a surface schema. Let's start. Talking about benefits of uh, surface schema usage, three things comes to the top of my mind. First thing, it eliminates something called surface scum. Now I'll, I'll give you an, you know, sort of a demo of what a surface scum is all about. But simply put, a surface scum is a layer, a oily film that you might have seen on the top of your aquarium. Okay. It can also come from dust, but normally this oily film is because of bacteria, fungi, dead bacteria and fungi typically which accumulates and it actually floats to the surface and creates a layer on top of the surface. Okay. What this layer does if not cleared properly is that it actually inhibits exchange, gaseous exchange. Okay. So we have air, we have this air above the water. If there is this surface come then it will not let the gas, gaseous exchange to happen and that, that over time leads to many problems. It can lead to fish suffocation, it can lead to algae formation and so many things. So the number one benefit of using a surface skimmer is to eliminate this skim. It skims the surface, takes out the oily film, right? That's number one. Let's come to the number two. Number two is an obvious benefit. Once the layer is eliminated, if you don't have the oil layer, then light penetration becomes that much more. Whatever little, the oil will definitely interfere with the light penetration. So if you have a clear water surface, then light penetrates better. That's number two. And there is number three, which is very uh, typical of this particular model of uh, surface schema. Uh, one caveat, I'm going to discuss now about OASE crystal scheme, okay, surface schema. I, as I always tell, there are many models of surface schema available. It's not necessary that you have to use this model, but then this particular model has this benefit, additional benefit to which I am going to talk about. So this is OASE surface schema, crystal scheme uh, 600. Okay, uh, you can see it the by design, and I am going to show you later. It it is going to suck the water from the top, and it throws out water from the bottom. Okay, so. Friends, we all know that in planted aquarium, there is this problem of dead spot happening, okay, where you have might be having an external filter, but it, it is not actually sufficient to throw water to in, you know, in, in uniformly over the entire aquarium volume. So this particular addition to the aquarium, what it does is that because the water is coming out like this, it also creates an additional flow in the aquarium, right? And as we all know that if you have more flow in the tank, you will have much lesser chance of algae happening. So these are the three, uh, I think, uh, important benefits of having a surface schema in your planted tank. I said that elimination of surface scum is very, very important for any aquarium. Okay. I have created a small uh, model here. Okay. Uh, where I, I, I am actually not able to create a surface scum, but I want to leave this impression with you. So this is an aquarium, you see the water here. And what we have done is that we have created tight covering on top. So when surface scum actually happens, it creates an invisible layer like this. Okay. And it creates a tension. It actually inhibits. If you had this kind of a layer on top of your aquarium, then no gaseous exchange can happen. Okay, this is the problem. What surface, you know, uh, surface scum does. Okay, this layer formation and this layer is eliminated by this equipment. So we must use this equipment. Understood, like what are the benefits of using a surface schema? Now we are going to actually unbox and install this OASE surface crystal scheme 600. Okay, um, mentioning again. 
there are many varieties of surface camera available in the market you choose whatever you feel the best but in our opinion this is a good surface skimmer you can always give it a try so let's go ahead and do the unboxing and setup surface skimmers from the german aquarium technology specialist oase comes in two variants crystal skim 600 and crystal skim 350 the 600 is powered by a 4.5 watt noiseless motor and has a flow rate of about 450 to 600 liter power hour this model frankly was much larger for the aquarium we used for this video but then this was only for demo for smaller aquarium you must go for crystal scheme 350 this skimmer comes with a two-year warranty which you can extend by another year the warranty card is provided within the package the other important thing is that uh, a very detailed instruction manual is given you should go through it but I would also recommend strongly to go through the other WASA websites. They have got very detailed uh, instructions on what you should do or what you shouldn't do as far as the installation is concerned. We were actually very surprised to find a tweezer in the packaging. Uh, frankly, we couldn't figure it out why they have given a tweezer. Was it given for aquascaping? No. So definitely there is use of it. Uh, I'm keeping it a secret for the moment. Uh, in the later part of the video, I'll explain why the tweezer was given. When you hold the skimmer, the thick and strong plastic body gives a definite sense of a solidly built product. They have indeed designed a very compact product. The only part that uh, we felt is rather weak and needs a little careful handling is that, you know, the acrylic adjuster at the top of the portion which actually floats. Uh, you need to uh, handle it with some care. The strainer on the top definitely can stop small fish or shrimps from going inside the schema. But then I'm afraid the gaps in the crossed weights are big enough for baby shrimps to get in. Nothing much can be done about that. Now when you take the strainer off and you look inside, you can see the blue sponge. This has been given to filter out the biofilm, the scum, plant matters, moss cuttings, etc. And while looking at the sponge, we actually figured out why the tweezer was given. Frankly, without the tweezer, it would be very difficult to take out the sponge and to clean it. I must say that the product designers of OASE have given a lot of importance to end-user comfort of usage while designing this product. Talking about design, there are quite a few other aspects uh, in which uh, Crystal Skim 600 is different from other schemers available in the market. First, let's talk about the water flow. Like other skimmers, uh, Crystal Skim sucks in water from the top. But as I have mentioned before, the water comes out from the bottom through a relatively larger outflow area. This eases out the water flow and does not cause too much of turbulence. But then you must keep in mind the height of the aquarium, as even with this smooth outflow, it can cause a disturbance if you uh, put the skimmer in a low height aquarium. For example, this uh, 600 OS Crystal Skim 600 is definitely not suitable for aquariums with height less than one and a half feet. The other aspect is the floating component uh, with that acrylic adjuster on the top. This can accommodate a water level difference of about three centimeter automatically so that you do not have to really top up water if some evaporates. This is indeed a very useful feature. The way the skimmer is fixed in the aquarium is also very unique. Most skimmers have the suction cups fixed to the body of the skimmer as you can see here. But in the case of crystal skim, the suction cups are fixed to a separate sturdy acrylic holder and not directly to the body of the skimmer. What this does is that, first, the wear does not push the glass wall. But more importantly, when you are wanting to clean the skimmer, it can be easily removed from the acrylic holder. No hassle with removing the suction cups, but simply remove the schema, clean and replace the schema. Nothing further my friends, I, ho I hope I have covered most of the design aspects which makes Crystal Scheme a very unique product. Okay, uh, let's just power it on and enjoy its smooth but sheer flow.
we have now seen the unboxing and the installation steps of the os surface scheme okay surface schema that six that particular model that is was a crystal scheme 600 was rather big for that 60 centimeter aquarium so what we did is that we had some flow problems in this 90 centimeter aquarium so we have installed the surface schema here and what i wanted to show you is that water is getting sucked from the top right it is getting sucked from the top you can see the movement on the top also and the water is now actually coming out from here the water is coming out from here and it is creating a flow you can see the co2 we, we have intentionally put the skimmer here so that we can show, show you the flow actually we will place it in the back of the aquarium so it is creating a flow here which is actually creating an additional flow which this tank needed okay so friends you have seen the benefits of this beautiful equipment and i'm sure you're going to use it in your aquarium and believe me you are going to get amazing benefits out of it one last thing i forgot okay many of your hobbyists are dog lovers also actually many hobbyists come to me who have pets in their house and they say that you know the hairs come out you know and it kind of floats around and it it kind of covers your aquarium surface so the surface skimmer will also help you to remove the dog hairs or the you know the hairs that come out of the fur from the top of your aquarium fine thanks for watching friends if you have liked our content do subscribe to our channel ripples nature inspired aquarium that encourages us and to bring more such content to you and if you have already started using surface skimmer then please do leave your comments and your experience in the comments down below you know that would be beneficial for us and other viewers of the channel thank you